846 now. This morning we're talking about all the movies you can stream right now from the comfort of your couch. Alfred Richard is joining us now to talk more about that. Hey, Alfred. Hello there, Sheba. Here from the secret broadcast cave. There you go. The secret broadcast cave. And listen, everybody <laughs> is watching movies right now. You know I never watch TV and even I'm watching TV. So tell us our best options. All right, and best options. Now, first of all, there is the ongoing TCM Film Festival that is taking place. But first, we're going to jump ahead right now. We're going to go to one of the films on Hulu that you can get. Now, a lot of these films are for free. A lot, of course, you have to pay for. One of them you're seeing right now, Bend It Like Beckham. And that's a film that came out just a few years ago, telling the star of David Beckham and the young lady who wants to be just like Beckham, the great soccer player. There's also the full Monty, which is a good one I think that you would enjoy, Sheba, okay. as yeah. well. And the Prestige. Now this one is a precursor to Christopher Nolan's great work with Batman and Batman Begins. Uh, this one here stars Christian Bale and Hugh Jackman as two magicians that are constantly going against each other, trying to outdo each other. Very good film there. Awesome. There also, we also have a couple other choices. I mentioned the TCM Film Festival is going on right now. You can either watch it on Turner Classic Movies or TCM.com. And they'll have different films. Like, for example, last night I had a chance to watch A Star is Born. And they'll be showing constantly different movies like Some Like It Hot, Spartacus, classic films that everyone can enjoy. And the AFI, the American Film Institute, will do a daily film for, the, for people to watch and stream at home. It's at AFI.com. You can check your listings to see what today's listing is. Last night was Yankee Doodle Dandy with James Cagney. Really good one there. And Elson, what is this Stay the Heck at Home Festival? That is the TCM. That's what they're calling it. They were going to have a big film festival in Los Angeles and Hollywood. And since I was not approved to go do that, no, I'm kidding, of course, they are now doing a Stay the Heck at Home Film Festival where from last night all the way until Monday morning, they'll be running special features, films, and excerpts from previous TCM film festivals. Really good entertainment there. Oh, that's a lot of fun. Okay, what about Netflix? Everybody's watching Netflix these days. Well, there are a couple on Netflix that I really like, and this is one that we're, you may remember it won Oscars and got a lot of consideration a few years ago. It was called Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon. Has nothing to do with being the Tiger King or whatever that matter, but it is. <laughs> I a, did watch that one though. <laughs> I figured that you would watch the Tiger King. And I have, but this one here is beautifully shot. The cinematography is wonderful and the acting stellar. It was an Oscar nominated film and it's a film that I think people could rediscover again. And I've always loved these animated films and one of this on Netflix this week is a Sean the Sheep movie called Farmageddon. Yes, Farmageddon. <laughs> the name's cute. What's this one about? Well, well again, Sean is back again. He is a wonderful little sheep who is trying to deal with his own farm life. But when an alien being crash lands on the farm, he has to deal with it. And of course, the farm animals are trying to deal. You see also the creatures try to like toilet paper for sure. some reason. So I guess they're in the same mode that we all are. Hilarious. But Sean well, the sheep, Farmageddon, very good for the family, for kids as that's well. That's great, trying to keep the people they're trying to keep the kids busy at home. And who's quickly, who's the cute baby behind you? The cute baby to my right is my great, great niece, Ariel. And she's a beautiful little girl growing up. And I also have a little picture here. I have to honor my late niece, great niece, Brielle. But she's a beauty as well, a beautiful little angel. I know the camera's not getting a good shot of it, but there she is, the little angel of our family. And I want to say again, Thanks everyone from the Secret Broadcast Cave. And if I get permission from the Six Sand Stompers again, I might do another dance for you, but Gorgeous not today. Gorgeous family, and I will be waiting for a dance next time. Thanks, Alfred.